Hey y'all. Um, if you hear things in the background dripping and it's been raining out here. We've had thunderstorms all day. But I figured it'd be nice to do a um, do a tutorial. So what we're looking at is one of the paintings that I just finished. I took my pastel and I turned it into an oil painting. And uh, so I did everything. And you can see a little bit where I put some a halo around it. But I want to put a little more of a halo. But I just want to show you guys how I did it. Okay, what I do is I just take a little bit of color. And how I choose my color to do the halo is um, I just check out whatever color that I like in the, the painting. Um, and I balance it to what would actually balance the painting. Like say for red, red's in here, pink's in here, and then the complementary to it, green is also in here. So I figured that's a good balance for that. But yellow, I have yellow in here as well, and I wanna balance that yellow out. So the complementary to that is lavender, purples, that type of thing. So the lavender that I made is just basically, it's just a doxazine purple and white. And all I'm doing is just putting them around the flower. And I'll put a little bit around here too. Go. And then what I'll do is I'll take a piece of my paper towel, which I use Viva because they're super soft and they have no um, texture to them. And you just rub them. And it just depends on how much you want, how much of a halo that you want. Sometimes I like a lot, sometimes not so much. Just wipe it away and it'll leave that little bit of a glow there, which is what oh, halo. Go. You can even, I normally sometimes take my finger. A lot of people don't like that because there are in the pigments there are minerals that are toxic so if you do that wear a glove I'm not doing it because after I do this I go straight in and um, wash my hands this rain is calming down a lot of the, the insects which I'm happy about because insects out here in the swamp is merciless Here come the frogs. Okay, so that's a little bit of um, of a halo. To me, I just, I like halos because it's something that I discovered, which I'll show you guys in a separate, separate video, um, how our eyes seem to pick up form and, um, and for whatever reason, our eyes pick up halos around everything. We don't really notice it unless it's up against a white background. Um, but I'll show you later on a, on a separate video how to, how to detect those, the halos that kind of, it kind of helps the eye to, uh, form objects and such. Anyway, so we're about to do another painting here, so I'm gonna let you guys go and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.